on with the questions for this week. Uh, ask Bill. Um, this is a very interesting question, and um, I think I might need a little bit of help on this one because this goes outside the realms of uh, what I've been doing with my life. Um, Bill, I've been meaning to ask you. I'm afraid that when I'm an adult and have responsibility that I will not be able to smoke weed. I'm not a pothead. I smoke about a few times a week, more in the summer. Um, I get decent grades at a decent school. I feel like professional and family life won't allow me to blaze anymore. This is what I love about this is right up until then, right up until he says the word blaze, I'm really, I'm really believing this guy, you know, whatever, you know, I smoke a couple of joints a week, you know, I do well in school, had a great school, you know, I'm very responsible, I don't drink and drive a couple times a week, I have a, if he said I have a couple of tokes, no big deal, I get it, you know, you want to watch Laverne and Shirley and eat fiddle faddle, I don't have a problem with that, you know, but once you say blaze, I'm just, that, that's at least, isn't that like blunt level? Because I always just, I mean, I'm not a pothead. I don't even smoke this shit. So I, I just picture blaze, meaning that there has to be some sort of significant source of fire to get that joint going, like it's that big. Maybe I'm wrong because I'm a booze hound. So anyways, he goes, do you think this is true? Do you think anyone, uh, do you know anyone your age or older who do smoke? <laughs> decent grades at a different, at a decent school. Okay. Do you know anyone your age or older who do smoke? All right. Um, the, this is my feelings on on weed. I don't think it's that bad, um, especially nowadays. We can get like a vaporizer. Check that out, or go to uh, the mm. What is it? www.themmppodcast.com, and I'll have a picture for you. I guarantee it. Um, a vaporizer is basically you, you you put the weed in there, you light it on fire or whatever the fuck you do, and it basically filters out everything except what gets you high. Now, that has to be way more healthier than sitting down and finishing a six-pack, isn't it? I guess it depends if you get the munchies and then you go out and eat cake and ice cream. I have no fucking idea. But anyways, I think, yeah, I, there's, you know, I know people who are married and have kids. And, uh, you know, every once in a while they go out, send their kids to bed, have a couple of puffs. But, you know, you know, kids, they'll figure out what you're doing. That's the only thing. You have to really hide it because uh, I, I don't think I would smoke weed in front of my kids ever because even though I don't think it's any worse than having a beer, it isn't. It really isn't. Um, the thing is, is you are knowingly breaking the law and it is considered like, you know, you're on drugs or for some reason alcohol isn't, which is complete bullshit, but it is. So to just do that in front of a kid, and you know how kids, they always want to outdo you. They see you drinking a six pack. They're gonna to try to go for, you know, at least eight to twelve. I don't know. So I would just be worried. This is with no psychological, you know, psychology background or any of that shit. I would just think if you, if your kid saw you smoking weed, that he would be smoking weed by at least seventh or eighth grade, maybe tenth if he was a fucking nerd, at that point. But um, and then I don't think it would be that big a leap to coke. I really wouldn't. Now. I know, potheads, this is like a fucking big thing with you guys. Well, it's just bullshit. It's just bullshit. There's no proof that it's a fucking gateway drug. Really? I think it is. Because everybody I know went that route. You started off with booze, then you went to weed, then you went to coke, and whatever else. So you are weed, you went to coke, or they had crank. Anybody remember that shit? Um, or whatever else you did. Took pills, whatever you did. You are just like, whatever. It's acid. But you always went weed first. I mean, as far as I know, that's how uh, people who I didn't hang out with in high school did it. Look at me, still being a fucking friend, not throwing anybody under the bus. Uh...